హే హాయ్ వెల్కమ్ టు సోషియో క్లిక్కా we all know that we have plenty amount of water on this planet earth of which about 97% amounts to oceans and seas and only 3% amounts to fresh water and in this 3% glaciers and ice caps amounts to 68.7% and ground water amounts to 30.1% and the remaining 1.2% is the surface water like lakes rivers water vapor etc and one thing we need to understand is the total amount of water on the earth or in the earth is always constant unless or until it is collided by any other outer space body due to some chemical reactions in the atmosphere the bond between hydrogen and oxygen molecules may break down but fortunately that loss is very very negligible negligible even if we consider some thousands of years now coming to the point nowadays we used to see and hear that the availability of fresh water is decreasing and the ground water level is alarming you may heard about the chennai issue many schools and even companies were closed in chennai just because of water crisis now there is no water under the chennai chennai is being supplied with water from different locations this issue became viral on an international level this became viral just because chennai is a city which is having many international companies many schools many colleges and with a population of about 75 lakhs then what about the remote areas and villages where the media is not even looking at there are many areas in india or even in the world where the people are dying just because of thirst in many villages across the world especially in india and africa women are walking miles of distance just to collect the water for their family you may be going to a reliance mart or a d mart which is just beside you to buy the unnecessary stuff like cool drinks cookies and chips but think about those women who are walking miles of distance just to have a sip of water remember if you are wasting water i am telling you if you are wasting water you are the reason for many deaths in the world but why why all this is happening what are the reasons behind this even the water is constant and abundant why we are so worried let me tell you some of the main reasons for that even the water is abundant the availability of water on earth is in different forms and most of the forms are useless or we are not trying much to make them useful we have only 3% of fresh water available in the total water i am telling you again and in this 3% ground water holds about 30.1% and only 1.2% is folded by surface water The remaining 68.7% is in ice caps and glaciers and we are not going to this ice caps to collect the water so we left with only approximately 31% of the total available fresh water which is even less than 1% of the total water on the earth and the second reason is the number of consumers are increasing drastically as per wonder police report we are total about approximately 8.7 million species across the world and the sad thing is all other species are becoming endangered and human is becoming dangerous towards them and the main reason which i feel for the depletion of ground water is roads and pavements yes we don't want the mud or soil to touch our feet we want everything to be neat and clean we want everything to be concreted so we built roads and concrete grounds everywhere so where does the rain comes and sit there is no place especially in urbanized areas so all the water which fell on ground drains off fortunately or unfortunately even the drainage system is also concreted so all the water is directly flooding into the oceans without any absorption into the soil and we are constructing dams at the end of rivers to stop flooding 
we are creating a problems and finding a cure for that curing definitely will work out but how extent is my question to you so we need to stop creating a problem and should find a solution for the existing one but how we all know rain water harvesting is a method to conserve water i have made a separate video for explaining that that video link i given in the description below i request you to watch it for the complete understanding of water depletion and its solutions now let's go back we are talking about reasons right and one more main reason for ground water depletion is the usage of plastic yes you may wonder but that's true because of the plastic layers formed under the earth's crust soil is not able to absorb the water completely and hence ground water refilling is not happening properly and the last main reason which i want to tell you in this video is deforestation how this deforestation could really affect the underground water normally the roots of trees beneath the soil hold soil as well as water so there will be a less chance for flooding in the dense greenery areas unfortunately we can't stop cutting trees while the occupants are increasing on a global level see in fact all the problems in the world are somehow interrelated population pollution global warming plastic uses infrastructure what not if you sit and think you can write thousands of problems in the world all these problems are somehow or somewhere interrelated as we are talking about the water crisis all such problems are somehow or in some portion related to water depletion in fact we need to solve each and every problem to save our natural resources it seems very difficult task right yes we do that to such extent but it's okay with a little effort and time we can save our natural resources for ourselves and for our future generations but ha ah, let us see that in our next video that video link i given in the description below please watch it you gonna like it what is your opinion on global fresh water crisis there can be many other reasons than what i mentioned in this video if you know any other reason please give a comment below i thank you so much for watching this video please give a like to this video and share to as many as you can